you both of y'all, both teams are hitting a lot of threes and hitting sets and killer ones. I mean, there's not much to say. I mean, we're a championship team. Um, they have a great offensive system. They have a lot of great players. Uh, KD, Steph, uh, and then Clay. I mean, it opens up a lot. It's just tough to get back and know who you have. Uh, but that's a great teaching message for us. And what were they doing defensively so early on that they, you know, that you went scoreless in the first? Um, first, first quarter, I was just trying to figure out and see how they're playing me. Um, I, I hit for you, just got into a rhythm. But they're just, they're just playing back. Um, and I was just trying to see what they do with those picks. So, and they played it well. How were, uh, how were you guys feeling at halftime um, coming in here? Uh, good. We felt good. Uh, we were in a good place. Uh, moving the ball well, the best we were playing well. Uh, and then just came down to the second half, obviously. Before the game, Steve Kerr called you a bulldozer. He also said that they were going to try to limit you in transition. What did you see from them in that aspect? Uh, I think they did a good job of that, uh, loading the paint. Uh, I think I could have been more aggressive, uh, attacking more of it. We see them in a few weeks. Brett was, sorry, uh, Brett was talking before the game about how guarding guys like Steph is part of your evolution. I know you weren't on the whole game, but how do you think that went, and what are you learning about some of these matchups when you're on more true traditional point guards? Um, I think it went well uh, for the first time. He's a great player, so obviously it's tough guarding somebody like that. Um, but I think it went well. And what do you... Not to say silver lining, but the fact that you do get to face them in such a short period of time, how does that help you for the next game? Uh, we know what to expect. You know, we know we know their strengths, um, but for us, we know where we need to uh, correct our errors. I mean, is that in some ways like for someone who never has played them before, and is that almost like one of the keys you experience it for the first time? Yeah, the yeah. first, I'll say in the J, the first quarter for me, um, I was just trying to settle in and see how it went, um, and see how they're playing, and just trying to read it. I think I did a pretty good job early on reading it. Um, but obviously, again, as a championship team, um, it doesn't get any better than that. Talk about going up against Draymond. He's obviously the defensive player of the year, and he sagged off you a bit. But what else does he do well so defensively that makes him tough to score on? Uh, uh, communicates a lot. Um, great communicator on the court. Uh, everybody knows where he's at. Uh, he's athletic. He uses his reach. He can time it well, obviously, uh, jumping off the ground. So he's a great player.